Welcome to Cololab 101. My name is Dado Valentik and I am the creator of Cololab. And in this course, I'm going to take you through following parts. First, we're going to learn about history of Cololab, how it was created and where it was used. Then we're going to see what it does. I mean, it is important to understand why was Cololab created and what it does differently than the other software. Then also we're going to see how to install Cololab plugin and then how to correctly arrange nodes inside DaVinci in order for Cololab to be able to deliver the color managed workflow. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to understand the interface of Cololab, which parts do what, and then also we're going to understand the advanced color signs behind Cololab and how it's implemented inside. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to create our first look just a neutral look and then the same look we're going to apply to different cameras. First, we're going to export a lookup table that we can use inside DaVinci or any other application or uh, send it to set to be used as a show LUT or uh, we're going to see how to best create looks when working with RED, how to best create looks when working with ARRI, Panasonic, Sony and also what to do if we already have footage that is in Rec. 7 or 9 color space and how we can still use Cololab to color manage that workflow. At the end, we're going to see when uh, to use cinema spaces and other output options inside the Cololab in the best way. Without further ado, let's start with the course.